And we're going to talk about immigration reform in a moment. But maybe I'll just begin by saying to your sheriff here, Mr. Apayo, why don't you pick on people who have the power to fight back? Stop picking on children like Catherine and others. And let me begin by saying, as I have said before, that if elected president, we are going to pass comprehensive immigration reform and a path towards citizenship. Whether Mr. Apayo likes it or not, And if the Congress does do, not, doesn't do what it's supposed to do, we will use the executive powers of the presidency to the full extent possible. It is not acceptable to me and a vast majority of the people in our country that 11 million undocumented folks are living in the shadows, they're living in fear, they are being exploited, and that has got to end. I know a little bit about the immigration experience. My dad was an immigrant, came from Poland, and all of us have got to do everything that we can to make sure that people in this country are not living in fear.